And more mall. Still more mall left. Also, we have a new guest. Hello, guest. Hey, hi. Thanks for inviting me. My name's Phil. Hello, Phil. Hi, Phil. Welcome to the malls. It's malls all the way down here. Mm -hmm. Great. Perfect. So uh, you what? know, I was hoping to do some shopping. This is perfect timing. Maybe we can find a Cinnabon. Mmm. Mm, delicious. Now, this part was a little unintuitive to me. Because it's sort of like, oh, that's where we need to head. That's where Joel is. We're pretty close. So, just clamber our way up here. That was a little non-obvious. Yep. It's all downhill from here. Yeah, this is interesting because I'm, I'm coming in on the part that, uh, where we get to kind of see the thing that I didn't like very much about The Last of Us. Even oh. though I, I like this DLC quite a lot. Mm -hmm. um, but this the, the finale that we're coming up on is, uh, yeah, I, is, I think, probably the weakest part. I definitely agree. Which, I, I still had fun with this encounter, but I didn't like the final. Yeah, fight. it's that final fight. I, I'm interested to see how Spoilers, you... Spoilers, uh... everybody, there's a final fight. <laughs> I'm excited, I'm blind in this. <laughs> okay, I'm interested so... to see how you approach it. Yeah, so there's a, a whole bunch of uh, spooky infected, and right here, this is from my initial playthrough. I'm kind of like, how are we going to do this? But, but... So we progress a little bit forward. Wait for what it. What was that? Mm -hmm. I think she reacted to them saying, what's that? But a oh. human showed up. Oh boy. Lucky you! Yeah. Another reason why you must have subtitles when you play this game. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Okay. I just need a noisemaker, but where am I gonna. Where am I gonna find a noisemaker? Hmm. Oh! How about that? It's in your brick pocket. Yep. My brick, my brick satchel. <laughs> I love when they freak out. <laughs> oh, last time... Last time the infected tore apart the humans. Let's see what happens this time. Maybe lend a helping hand. Oh, I love those nail bombs so much. Mm, just kinda... Let's see. I'm kinda debating whether I should close in or just kind of spectate from afar. There are a few... There are a few boxing matches going on right now, but hey... Let's, uh, leave a little present. <laughs> I love oh, that. Shit. He did a wrestling move right on top of that. <laughs> hmm. And there's just one infected and one dude. That was a hell of a fight. Yeah, let's go ahead and close in. Let's find that old man. Oh. Well, that's that. He won! He's all by his lonesome. Go mankind. Now we gotta kill him. Maybe there's hope after all. Hmm. So, Phil, when you played this, did you make much use of Ellie's knife? Because it's pretty broken if you use it right. <laughs> uh, for, for, like, up-close melee kills? Yeah, it's basically an infinite-use shiv. Yeah, yeah, no, I... I... That was definitely the thing that I used the most, to the degree that, like, the first time I got to this fight, actually, um, I did not handle it as as wisely as you have here. Um, I almost, oh. I almost snuck <laughs> nice up on him perfectly. But I kind of snuck this. I, I sneaked when I should have snuck, or something. But I just kept trying to stab everybody. That was my. That was the problem. I, it was so satisfying and so uh, so crazy overpowered. Okay, and uh, I cut out a lot of scrounging because it was boring. Also, also, hold it. PS3. Perfect. Huh. There we go. But yeah, there's there's not, nothing interesting in the store, and I t spent way too long, so this is just behind where we oh, killed you gotta the guy. throw a brick at the PS3. You gotta break that thing. <laughs> My PS3 did brick once in the past. I don't want to think about it. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> waka, waka. Get out. Hmm. Nothing here. 
Yeah, we're done with the um, uh, collectibles and such. And right through here. Oh, it's the Indian. Yep. Hooray! Yep. And the princess DLC playing was like right across the uh, the hall from that. And there are some dead dudes here. Free arrows, though. Yep. Probably fine. Mm -hmm. Hey, I hear the fucking. It's a good sign, I'm sure. Let me get the door. Yeah, yeah, we get the door. You gotta keep searching. You wanna get ambushed? Pick up Now. They start. All right, in the dick. They're messing around with the lock <laughs> I left behind. I gotta do and something. Fast. I've never waited it out. I don't know if you're on an actual timer or not, but I kind of assumed it from playing. Fucking door! Let's see, is anybody gonna go near that? It made yeah, a noise. I, I guess I never tried waiting it out either. That's, that's interesting, okay. I wonder. So, there are a lot of dudes, and even though I'm playing on normal, uh, my hands are still pretty tied on re the resource front. I, I, I'm glad I didn't try hard. <laughs> Survivors probably probably don't have anything just about. Holy shit, that's a lot of dudes. Yeah. Shank them. Mm -hmm. Blade master them, Geop. <laughs> Do it. Uh oh. Uh oh. That mannequin in that store is really creeping me out. When I first when I first <laughs> played this, I thought something was up with that. But no. Okay. Element of surprise. Nice. Good job. Come on, bat out! Blade Master. Kidney. Oh. Yeah, they don't know that Joel's injured, I guess. And the issue with the bow is because they know where I am, it'll take two shots to bring someone down unless I peg him in the head. Hmm. Get this dude in the creepy mannequin store first, yeah. unless he went somewhere. Well, that's the thing. There's a stairway in the back of here. Oh, so there's a second yeah. route you can use to get downstairs. Sneaky. I remember <clears throat> getting trapped at this point like on the stairway at a point where it was reloading um, and there were guys at the bottom and guys at the top and it was not <laughs> it was not a good good situation well this guy's trying to be clever well <laughs> you get a prize fuck him up drinking problem <laughs> intervention oh god <laughs> You see, they're trying to flank me, and I'm kind of lucking out. Uh, this is a this is a Molotov guy. He's kind of bashful, though. So, hey there. Let you up. Who are you even talking to? <laughs> Ellie's not good for a fist fight. <laughs> Oh, God, she's good at shanking the kidneys, though. Jesus. Well, that was in the belly right there, wasn't it? Ugh. The guts area. I don't know. Where all the organs go. She's good at stabbing people. Ugh. And there's one or two guys left on the ground. Wow. Two. Oh, it, Whoa, It just what? appeared. Okay. <laughs> One's a ghost. This is serious. Uh, that was a miracle of nature. Did no, there's you three of them, actually. Where, okay, now where there's babies one. come from. Whoa. There we go. All done. And that's it for this encounter. Whoop. It's a cash register, Geoff. It can't hurt you. Whoa! That might, though. A lot of dudes. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, I, I kind of forgot you could do that. I just scraped your arm like that. That's that. That's it, DLC's over. Huh. Great. Mm -hmm. What a good resolution. Mm -hmm. 
happy ending for everybody. Roll credits. Awful. Candy bar. So is that the uh, the encounter that you're saying is disappointing, Phil? Well, Maybe. I don't want to spoil anything. <laughs> okay. Because that was that was a little that was just like here's a bunch of guys. I mean, I do you know the where where uh, where the Last of Us gets weak for me is when you're fighting a lot of guys and when the only solution that you have is to just kill all of them, um, mm. which is certainly the case here. Uh, so that. That's part of it, certainly. I really liked um, when when they gave you stealthing as a very good option. They threw you in an out and out, down and out gunfight. Sometimes it was a little not stilted, but just I don't know. I had fun with it though. So. It's not as satisfying to just shoot dudes. Yeah, yeah. it's, and it's that, way more satisfying to see through. Whoop. And that's part Whoa. of what I liked about this there, DLC in general is uh, playing as playing as Ellie. Up until this point, you're not usually expected to just shoot dudes. You want to do this? Yeah. <sighs> She's much more, uh... She benefits from the stealth and from the one that kills. So there are, like, three guys upstairs, and there are three more coming downstairs to my left. Fuck. And I'm getting... Lucky I hit that guy. But, yeah, shit. Okay. No way, no at all. I'm amazed I got this on my first try. Whoop, whoop. You did much better than me. <laughs> it kind of just... I don't really know who to go to right now because everybody's got a good angle. So... Whoop. Oh man, they are sneaky assholes. Yes, I do have a gun. I'm surprised you're just now finding this out. Oh, another guy behind me. Ugh. Knife fight! Knife fight! <laughs> this, this thing is the DLC is actually meant to um uh, meant to shed some light on Ellie's pit fighting career. Mm-hmm. Long flashback sequence dealing with that. Mm-hmm. This guy. Break this guy. Break him in his face. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. Mm. The thing is, that guy on the left has, um, he doesn't have a handgun. He has something that looks a little bigger than that. Mm -hmm. Who the prick? Whoop. Whoa. So there's two over here. Good Molotov use, I approve. I love when they talk about Ellie. <laughs> it's just it's just great hearing these like hardened killers talking about like how this Damn little girl's kid. kicking their ass. <laughs> so yeah, even though Here we go. up to this point I think I've been pretty careful. Yeah, infected show up. The thing is, when I was playing this, I didn't register on that statement. Sure. So I, fi I see this suddenly, oh, there's more people. Kniff. Kniff. Okay. Did you take out the back of his fucking knees when you just did that? Holy shit. <laughs> the first stab looked like it hit him in the nards. Probably not, though. No. Oh, there's a guy right over there. Oh, he's infected. Let's go upstairs. Because now I hear a clicker. Oh, God. We're going to do that thing. No, that's not fair. Okay, so let's get a bit of air and let them kind of, uh, kind of butt heads. Hmm. This is a less than good situation. Hmm. So who who are you pulling for? You know, I always have to to root for the the hometown. Um, I think I think the zombies got this. Go state. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Uh oh. 
team spirit. Nope. I gotta root for the little girl and her magical horse companion. <laughs> Alive. Don't even think about surprising me. You line up like your friends. You hear me, Ellie? Ellie, no, yeah? no. Don't, don't taunt them. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? Uh, yep. That is the end of the encounter. Whew. So that was a lot of. That's a lot of dudes you're forced to fight at once. That that was like, what, like, a dozen total, fifteen total. In that second, in that second wave, you know, mm -hmm. with you know, including the part before and after the infected came. Yeah, absolutely. Now let's get some snow cones. Hooray! Better be alive, Joel. Delicious conclusion. Mm-hmm. Need to get the snow cone. This one's bitter. Barricade the door. Oh no, it's back to Heartbreak Central. <laughs> Jesus. Ellie. I gotta say, I prefer the sunny and sheer version of I Got You. But hey. Riley sure gave them a hand. Haha. Mm -hmm. uh. The up is like a bad influence. I'm over the dark side. He is. Find something to prop it up with. I'll hold it. Hurry! Also, also, we meet an early friend right around here. It's the scooty mechanism for holding up shutters. Oh, hooray! Mm-hmm. Okay! The only friend who you can depend on in any situation. Mm-hmm. Use the doorknob. I'm having trouble finding words because holy shit, this is intense. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they're behind us too. This way. Go, 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 go. They're getting closer. Just it really doesn't me. help that you know how it's gonna end. Yeah. It feel, makes it so much worse. It's kind of bad they make you run through those parts when they chalk those environments so full of stuff. It's sort of like I wanted to look around more in those rooms. Just ask her to hold up. Just could you? <laughs> could we go a little slower? I wanted to. I wanted to look around a little bit. I mean, we are. Game at the mall. designers worked really hard on this. <laughs> I know. Slow down. Reach up. I got you. Hold up. Oh, oh fuck. Ellie. Uh oh. <laughs> it's Thunderdome time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think it's clear. Ellie. Ellie, your arm. No, 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 no. She <sighs> up my heart. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. I've done this before. I'm kind so of an now. expert. 
Folks were asking how she knew how to stitch people up. Well, she apparently already knew about it. Maybe the military school thing Just taught you basic off. first aid. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Seems like a thing they would teach. <laughs> Lame. There's some more stuff over there you can break. Being a teenager is so hard. <sighs> so many subtle effects, like the blood smear on her side of her head that got there from her wiping her hand. Yeah. The way I see it, we got two options. Option one. We take the easy way out. It's quick and painless. I'm not a fan of option one. Two. We fight. For what? We're gonna turn into one of those things. There are a million ways we should have died before today. And a million ways we can die before tomorrow. But we fight for every second we get to spend with each other. Whether it's two minutes or two days. We don't give that up. I don't give that up. <laughs> My boo? That was pretty perfect for the mush part. Let's just wait it out. I'm sorry. Please leave that in. <laughs> you know, okay. we all poetic and just lose our minds together. What's option three? Sorry. Option three is you're immune. That, she doesn't know that, that yet. Wouldn't, that Shh. wouldn't happen. Spoilers. <laughs> and of course, they don't expose you to the whole thing about her turning and having to kill her. I'm kind of surprised they didn't, but you know, it's actually kind of nice, I guess, because it would have seemed like a cheap sort of a part string one sort of thing. Yeah, it's almost better left to your imagination. Yeah, it's after, like, hey. Especially after they've built up the whole, spend this whole DLC building up their relationship. It's like, you know what's going to happen, and it's almost more painful knowing and not seeing. Yeah, you already know how awful it's going to be. So, uh, Panzer, what was your take on this? I really liked it a lot. Like, it was... It really added a lot of character to Ellie. Um, not that she was lacking in character from the main game, but Jesus, it was just like... That arcade sequence and all of the, the camera sequence with, with Riley. I just, like, really... The, I enjoyed the learning the, the backstory. Pun no, like not the, the pun book! Like the Damn book. it! Yeah. That was the best part. <laughs> I can never escape the fucking pun book sequence, can I? I, I don't know, it was just, it was really sweet and nice until the part where they, um, got bit by zombies, but... <laughs> we all knew, knew where it was gonna go. Yeah, it was nice to see a little bit of her life from before. Hey, dogs! Dogs. Oh, but, oh. <laughs> oh. Now I'm extra sad. Uh, Phil, what was your take on this when you played it? You liked yeah, the uh, game? <clears throat> yeah, I, I did. I liked the focus on character. I liked that they were able to build a huge chunk of this this DLC, you know, approximately half of it, where there was no combat whatsoever, basically. Um, but that was the best part, was where there was it, no combat. I, exactly. Um, I loved that. I, I thought it was a... I thought it was a lot more bold than... So my, my you know, my issues with the, the original game were that, like, it had all these really great ideas and was doing these really cool things and then had to throw in really traditional video game combat on top of that. Um, and here they still have some of that. They have a little bit, but a lot less. And there was a lot more of the game, where, or of the DLC at least, where I thought uh, it felt like they were willing to take chances and to just like be like, we're we're just going to focus on the characters. Yeah, I can get why they worked in some of the fighting because it was supposed to be like you know 
right after the whole thing universe mm-hmm. Pro- probably less than a mile or two away because you know Joel yeah. had the whole stomach wound so but I'm glad they I would have liked seeing more opportunities to use the um, uh, humans versus infected sort of AI thing but it might have gotten played out if they did it for another encounter or two yeah, I agree. I almost kind of wish that they had had that in the in the original game, and that could have been another element that that lets you, uh, you know, like we were talking about, lets you avoid combat encounters rather than taking part in them. Like, um, just throwing zombies in there, like getting their attention, and then and then sneaking past. I would have liked to have seen wave after wave of mooks get get crushed by like a bloater or something. Yeah, <laughs> uh, that would have been fun. But yeah, so this is um, getting a fancy PS4 port, so that'll eh, that'll be worth a look, I guess. Maybe they'll have more AI combat interactions in the PS4 ports? I don't don't know if they'll work that in, but it is kind of early on, I mean, we can say. They probably won't, though, because that end up changing certain scenes and stuff, I think. Yeah, I get the sense I get is that it will mostly just be a visual upgrade, but... um, I would love if there were other changes as well. That would be really interesting. Let me have hopes, Phil. (laughs) Maybe there, you know, if if nothing else, that that maybe that's something they will. uh, Now that they've tested it in the DLC, maybe that's something that they'll work on uh, implementing in the inevitable sequel. The Last of Us Two, Last Harder. Mm -hmm. Oh, different spelling. (laughs) I saw John Kohler, and I was like, "Mm -hmm." (laughs) there are a few Kohlers at Sony, but all, all all spelled differently. And that's why that's why I'm anti Sony. <laughs> it all comes down to that. They're all doppel they're all doppelgangers. Yep. Oh well. But we're coming in on the end of the video and we're kind of uh, uh, how do we pat this? Mm. <laughs> My dog can start barking again. I was about to say, how about Cassie? <laughs> that was she is in a different floor of the house. I cannot believe she is that loud. You gotta get the dog's opinions on the DLC also. What does dog think of the brand new AI scheme of the DLC? <laughs> woof woof bark bark. What does dog think of the pun book? <laughs> God damn it, Gia. I'm so mad at you for the fucking pun book. Don't be mad at me, be mad at the joke button. So many good puns. So many. I hate you both. <laughs>